if you have e to the power of some function, taking the derivative of this is really easy. We're talking about functions like this, e to the 2x, e to the sine x, e to the root x, e to the power of some function. You can take its derivative using the chain rule, and here's how. If u is some function of x, then the derivative of e to the u by the chain rule is just e to the u multiplied by the derivative of that function in the exponent, which we could write like that, or if you prefer prime notation, we could write it like this, u prime e to the u. So to take the derivative of e to the power of a function, leave the e alone, but multiply by the derivative of that function. So let's try a couple of these. The derivative of e to the 2x, well, we just leave the e alone and multiply by the derivative of that function. The derivative of 2x is 2, so it's 2e to the 2x. What about the derivative of x cubed? Well, just leave the e alone, e to the x cubed, and then multiply by the derivative of that function in its exponent. The derivative of x cubed is 3x squared. What about the derivative of e to the tan x? Well, just leave the e alone, e to the tan x, and multiply by the derivative of that function in the exponent. The derivative of tan x is secant squared x. I invite you to try the other examples on your own. I'll put the solutions on screen now. So, how'd you do? Let me know in the comments if you have any questions, and be sure to check out my Calculus One course and Calculus One exercises playlists in the description for more. Thanks for watching.